Hi, I'm Phil Berman from Balanced Catamarans. I'm here in St. Francis, South Africa, where we build the Balanced 526, 580, and 620. A lot of people ask about carbonate balance and how we use carbon and what their options are for using carbon in their builds. All of our models employ the use of carbon fiber in high load areas of our hulls. We designate all of our Balanced Catamarans as what we call a carbon cross for this reason, because our catamarans represent a fusion, cross-pollination, of carbon with resin and closed cell foams in, in our, all of our fabrications. Because our clientele varies a lot in their performance desires and expectations, we also offer a range of carbon upgrades that enable them at additional cost to further lighten their boat, either for the purposes of going a bit faster overall or because they wish to buy weight savings. And the reason people like to buy weight savings is it just means that they can carry more gear and equipment without a measurable loss of performance. So either you lighten your boat with more carbon because you just want to go faster carrying the same payload as somebody else, or you lighten your boat because you want to put on more gear and equipment. We have one of our customers is heading off to the South Pacific and he's an avid kite boarder, surfer, paddle boarder. He's going to have just all kinds of equipment on his boat, plus a dive compressor, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And while our standard boats can carry all that equipment, by lightening the boat even more, he basically is not going to see a measurable degradation in his performance carrying that extra equipment. On the Balance 442 and 482 Carbon Cross Editions, carbon is used in the primary mass bulkhead, the aft beam, the jib hat track beams, the chain plates, and the daggerboard spars. And we also use carbon on these models for our sliding helm roof, cover, and all three of our custom crafted sliding doors. On the 526 and larger models, the Carbon Cross Edition uses carbon reinforcement in the same areas as the 482 and the 442, as pictured here in this video. In the Carbon Cross Plus Editions, buyers may choose from five different carbon enhancement options. They can get their hull, wet deck, and transom area, including the side deck and wet deck in all carbon. They can get their appendages and their daggerboard trunks, including the daggerboard trunking rudders and stocks in all carbon. They can get their deck, coach roof, and cockpit in all carbon. They can also get their deck and cockpit, including all combings, cockpit furniture, and aft beam, and coach roof top only in all carbon. And they can get their bulkheads, partitions, and soles, including all interior modules, bulkheads, and interior soles in their boat done in all carbon. And again, we picture this here in our many illustrations. The Carbon XP versions carry all five carbon options, including carbon hulls and decks, a full carbon epoxy construction. In addition to the above enhancements, of course, our customers can always order carbon masts, booms or beams, composite rigging, anything that they like. Any of our models that include such upgrades, we designate as Carbon Cross Plus models, and anything that's an all-carbon construction, we deem a Carbon XP model. With any of these upgrades that we offer, we include the weight savings that come with it, along with the fixed price that we add to it. This enables you to make a value decision for our weight savings versus cost. And we think it's very helpful for those people who are really very, very concerned about gaining even that additional amount of performance over our standard, already very fast carbon cross models. All of our boats sail very, very smartly. The question really is, where do you land in the balance curve? Do you want to go faster and faster and faster? And if so, at what cost? And what are you prepared to spend to do that? In the end, it's cool for us at Balance to build Carbon XP boats and racy Carbon Cats. It's exciting. We dig it. Uh, we're all racers, you know, from our past. And so it's a load of fun for us. Um, they'll go a bit faster than our standard boats for sure, uh, but not infinitely faster. There are other cheaper ways to save weight, of course, than adding carbon, but these often come at the expense of swapping out for cheaper, flimsier, less durable products than using a higher quality products. Just as an example, the windows on our boats, for example, are heavier than Lexan, but we deem them to be a quality decision that we're not willing to forego. Of course, also, you can easily remove cabinets and drawers and comfort conveniences from any boat, strip her out completely, and that'll save weight as well without resorting to carbon. Again, it becomes a question of where you want to land in the comfort balance curve, comfort balance performance curve, and it's really up to you at Balance Catamarans. I always like to stress that I have my own view of what constitutes a balance while others carry different views. When Anton and I set out to design these cats, we did so to achieve what we felt is the ideal balance of space, payload, comfort, quality, cabinetry, and hull volume at the most affordable possible price. We also work hard at balance to balance out strength, durability, livability, and performance to the best of our ability. I personally am no longer a racer, but a family cruiser, and I'm very happy with the performance of all of our standard carbon cross models. Our standard boats have proven themselves to be very competitive in the many rallies and races in which they participated, and they are extraordinarily 
high labor hour products compared to our competitors. And our aim is to put that time and labor into our boats to build top shelf, high performing catamarans that are really luxurious in terms of their feel and finish, and which offer people an opportunity to customize them. If you have the money, however, and you'd like to enjoy more and more speed or to carry more and more things without penalty, additional carbon indeed enables you to lighten any of our boats. I recall once chatting with a carbon fabricator, mass fabricator, and I said to him, you're telling me that it will cost our customers $160,000 more to save just 100 pounds of weight? And he said, yep, Phil, it's a big old Christmas present. I love sailing our boats in any configuration because I know that when I do arrive at anchor, I can be assured of living on a boat that lives well, cooks well, sleeps well, and offers the amount of cabinetry required to feel as I'm living in an organized home and not a Spartan camper van. Everyone must find the balance that's right for them. We simply enable our customers a great deal more choice in doing that. So until we see you again, or see you at a boat show, stay in balance.